car show to let you know about a great event for a yeah. great cause. Dave Stahl, KUSI's automotive expert, is here, and we got some Chevys from yeah. the 50s on this slot. Yeah, Come 55, on. 56, and 57. These are All beautiful. three are represented. We got Leon here. How you doing, buddy? Fine, thank you. Tell us about this uh, great event you got coming up. Well, it's uh, Picnic by the Bay. We have a flyer that we hand out to other car shows to get the word out. It's the, uh, we're having it down at the uh, next Sunday, like Jason said, on the 27th, down at the Embarcadero Marine Park by Seaport Village. Uh, we normally get like over 250 cars. It runs from nine in the morning to three in the evening. Uh, it's open to all uh, American cars uh, up through 1972. And uh, our, uh, the biggest thing the is, is, and it's free to come down and view. So folks right. want to come in, right. and then you're, and then you're the recipients of all the raffle prize donations, 50, all the things you're going to do to raise money, are going to go to the Warrior Foundation Freedom Station, Perfect. a local uh, charity in San Diego, helps the transition of military that are injured into the civilian life. Right. Can't ever get enough help. All right, so we got a whole great selections of 55, 56, and 57. We'll walk to the people over here that decided they wanted me to walk the farthest. Don't you know how early it is? Hi, how are you? Hi, fine. And your name? Margie. Vincent. Is this yours? Yeah. I had a sneaky feeling. Do you let him drive it every once in a while? He just gets to work on it, right? Uh, I don't drive it. What? You don't let her drive it? Well, she could if she wanted to. Yeah, you could end up with spam and eggs for a really long time. You know that. I know. Yeah, well, let's talk about it. How long have you owned it? 27 years. Wow. 27. And it's bone stock? Yeah, more or less. It's got the old school stuff. It's still got a carburetor. And it's still got points? Yep. And condenser? Yep. Nobody knew <laughs> And the original did. AM radio in the dash. <laughs> really? Right there. Oh, my God. Well, you can listen to AM 1170. <laughs> yeah. Today, I'll talk to you about radio. All right, now we'll go over to these two. They're chatting. They're, they're trying to discuss uh, who should talk and who should and who's he going to stick the mic at. How you doing, bud? Your name? I'm Steve Spierkoff. All right, I know you. Yeah. So did you, did you do all this work yourself? Yeah. Or did she do it? Well, she helped. Yeah, I know, I know. A little harder, a little to the left, a little to the right, right? Is that what you did? Oh, yeah. Yeah, he did a good job, didn't he? Yes, he did. Yeah. Scattered parts for me and all that stuff. Uh, yeah. That's is it getting difficult to find parts for these? Not these. They Man. make everything for them. And them. they repop almost everything, including the body, as far as that goes. All right, then we got this gentleman. Oh, yeah, this is a nice one here. Black on white. This is uh, all original color? No. You cheated? No, I bought it and it was black and white thirty years ago and then I re just finished restoring it in uh, March first. Oh, okay. Was it black and white even back from day one? No. What was it originally? Oh, I can't think of the uh, Don't you I can't hate think that? copper and beige. Copper and beige. Oh, you didn't like that color? Oh, well, somebody oh, else had yeah, done it, right? Somebody else yeah. had heard it. Copper and beige. That's that's a pretty rare color for uh, that car. Hey, how are you doing, buddy? I'm good. Got yourself a basic hard working two door. Uh, Any man. Yeah. And uh, this one was basically for the hard working guy, you know? I mean, was no glitz and glamour. Uh, right? That's true. Straight, straight six? <laughs> No, it's a 350. But originally, it was a straight six with yes. about a three-speed on the column. And yeah. if you wanted air conditioning, what'd you do? You rolled the windows down. Right. What's your name? Mike. All right, Mike. How long have you had her? Uh, since 1970. 1970. This, uh, this, is, this looks beautiful. Looks like it just rolled out of the restoration shop. Thank okay, you. so your wallet is empty. Yeah, this is what happens when you're uh, obsessive, compulsive, and uh, oh, have no. a little spendable income. I know some friends that are just like it. That's why this car <laughs> looks like their cars. I'm telling you. So, how long have you had her? I bought this in 04. Uh, it was a different car then. My wife and I wow. used it to tow a trailer around the country. We we toured the U.S. Really? Uh, with this car and a 25-foot ultralight. 23,000 miles over 18 months in every state. Yeah, okay. Never had a problem. Chris, uh, the, nope, car never put me this. on the shoulder once, there but that this. this has been completely rebuilt since then. Wow. This is a whole different car now. Still got the trailer? It's got the fins? Yes. No. Got No, She. we got back home to Huntington Beach. She was done trailering. Now it's a diesel pusher with slides and push button oh, and everything. there you go. That's kind of what I thought. <laughs> All right, now we'll come back here to the jump. This is yours, right? Yes, sir. How long have you had her? Uh, 50 years. It's March. 50? You can have a birthday party and everything for her? Uh, I tried, but nobody sent me cards. Ah, or at least car parts. <laughs> yeah, that'd so be good. good. Yeah. All right, so when is your event? Uh, August 27th, last Sunday of the month. Where is it? Embarcadero Marine Park North. And what gets to come? Uh, 72 and older American vehicles. All right, and anybody and everybody that wants to come down, it's totally free, get some exercise, bring the dog, cats, kids. 
Yeah, it just, leave, some money. just leave the bicycles at home, please. Yeah. Yeah. And bring some money. Yeah, well, bring some money. Yeah. It's, all it's, open, it's all free to the public. Yeah, and no leaning on the cars. That's true. There you but go. come down and see these cars in person. Oh, yeah. I mean, you got to yeah. see them in person. The stories are almost better than the it, cars themselves. Yeah, once exactly. you start digging into the stories, right. there are some great stories. All right, thanks, everybody. We'll be back with more Good Morning San Diego right after this. Thank you.